Hi ladies, it's Crystal. Um, signing in today. Today is um, today is March 28th and today is cycle day 26 for me. Cycle day 26. So I'm not all the way through the two week wait. Uh, I have a little bit more time left. But I don't feel pregnant at all. I, in fact, I feel pretty pissy and upset and just all I can think is that it didn't work. I don't feel anything I other than just feeling emotional if that's a symptom then by all means yes let's have it but I don't feel like that's what's going on here I don't know um, I am 12 days past IUI um, 12 days past IUI and I think Something like that. But it kind of really doesn't matter anyway because I didn't even ovulate till that Saturday. I know, I feel like I have screwed up the timing. I feel so frustrated right now. Um, yesterday I got home, I, yesterday I woke up for work and I mean, I just woke up on the wrong side of the bed. I woke up just feeling emotional and frustrated and angry I just felt angry so all day at work um, I was feeling frustrated and my actions I'm sure people knew that something was up you know that I wasn't my normal perky self um, and so as soon as I got in my car to go home from work I just that was it I was all of the feelings I was having all day that I couldn't really express because I had to be in a professional environment and keep my composure I just started to cry and Josh called me and I didn't really hear what he said. He was asking if he, if I wanted him to go get food and I thought he was asking me if I wanted to get food and I was just like, well, I was scatterbrained and I was totally out of it and I wasn't, I couldn't think of anything else other than, oh my God, this is, this has failed. It's not worked. It's not working. So I got home and he had was already gone. He'd gone to get some pasta for us. Um, I got home, or you know, I'm home. I'm crying. I'm frustrated. I'm just fucking a mess. Like, I don't normally get that emotional before my period. So, I mean, it's got to be the hormones or something. So, I'm crying, and Josh gets home. He's like, "Do you want to watch Lost?" And I say, "Yes." And I kind of vent out some things to him kind of here and there nothing like serious like I just tell him that I'm upset because I feel like it hasn't worked I feel like we've wasted another chunk of money we can't try for a whole another month if it doesn't work now because my left side doesn't work and I mean everything every negative thing that I could possibly feel I was feeling yesterday um, so I don't know I just feel like the thing the reason that I feel this way is because last time when I got pregnant in September like five days after the IUI, I felt pregnant. I I woke up one morning, um, I took my vitamins, I remember just all of a sudden my stomach hurt and I threw up, like just threw up. And then I remember like three more days after that, I got sick again and I just threw up. And then, I mean, by like day six after the IUI, my boobs were swollen, they hurt, my nipples hurt. I knew I was pregnant. And I don't feel any of that now. There was a couple little things that I felt. I remember I blogged about them, but I didn't post my blog. I just I just have like a a, a post that I'm I've been adding little things to that I thought might be symptoms. I didn't want to post them, you know, right away or anything, and I just didn't want to do that. So I um, I've been keeping a little notes of it, and so <clears throat> like day six after the IUI, day six I think after the IUI, I woke up in the morning and for half the day my cervix hurt, everything down there hurt. I felt like maybe it was implantation or something and I just, I mean it hurt to sit down. There was sensitivity going on down under and so I was like, oh yes, this is maybe a sign, maybe this is implantation and my, you know, my cervix is moving and all this stuff I'm thinking in my head. So, you know, I noted that. Um, there was a day that I kind of felt a little queasy, but I don't know if, I don't really know if it was because of it or anything. I just felt queasy. Um, there was um, another day also, like day five after IUI, that I felt really um, emotional, just really hardcore attitude, just rawr, pissy kind of. Um, but now I just don't feel anything. All I have, like I said, all I have felt if anything is emotions and frustration and short temper and just blah.
so I kind of feel like I'm not, like I said, I feel like I'm not pregnant. Um, I did um, probably about 10 minutes ago, I, I took a pregnancy test. I haven't looked at it yet. I have it sitting in my front window seal. Um, I, after Josh went to work, I, I um, decided to, to take it. I've got to put an end to this weight, this frustration. I can't go anymore, any longer. I'm just not good at this. I'm not good at the waiting. I'm not a good person at waiting. I can't just be super positive. I get irrit irritable and I get frustrated and I just cannot freaking handle it. I need an answer. <laughs> so <clears throat> my pregnancy test that I have is supposed to be one of those early pregnancy tests. Um, it's not super expensive. It's like store brand. I don't, I don't care really. But it is an early uh, pregnancy test, so I'm hoping that that will, you know, if it's if it's negative, then it's probably negative. Then I'm not pregnant, so I'm not going to really test after that. I think I'm just going to wait for my period to start. Um, looks kind of cloudy outside. Uh, um, <clears throat> anyways, I just am... Seriously, yesterday all I did was cry. I was in such a foul mood. And then I got in a better mood after the day kind of was coming to an end, but... I don't know. I'm about to go in there and look at my pregnancy test. I don't even want to get up and do it. I'm so scared. I just, I, fe I feel that it's negative. I feel that it's negative. If it's positive, I will be in shock because <clears throat> I'll just be in shock. Um, anyways, I guess, I guess I gotta go do it. Wow.